In this video, I will explain how you can use Amazon.com's free associates program to geolocalize your Amazon affiliate links to the country where the shopper lives. So for example, this is one of my pen names. And if I click on this link, I don't know if you can see in the bottom left corner, it's supposed to take people to Amazon.com. But when I click, it opens a new tab and it sends me to Amazon.ca because I am currently in Canada and this is where my Amazon account is located. So I did not pay anything special to a premium service to do this. I just used Amazon's one link feature. It's not perfect. It doesn't work for all countries, but I will show you where it relocates to. So you will want to join Amazon Associates, which is Amazon's affiliate program. It's free to join. And as you can see here, it is offered for several countries, but the link redirection to geo target your visitors is only available in the US and those countries here. Notice how Australia is not listed. So if you make a lot of sales to Australia and you want to make affiliate money from your Amazon Australia sales, you will probably want to pay for a premium service and this is not it here. So this one does not redirect with an affiliate link to Australia as of February 2021. Maybe one day they will. So first of all, you need to sign up for at least a US program. Keep in mind that if you don't earn anything, they will eventually shut down your account after a few months. So don't apply to countries where you don't earn anything. Wait until you're at a stage where you make regular sales from those countries to make it worth the hassle. And also uh, so that you don't have your account closed and then you'll have to reopen a new account. One thing to note when you do that, you will likely want to keep reusing the same username and password because if you want to use the same username, your email address, but a different password per country, you will open a big can of worms because Amazon will not let you do that. You will end up changing the password for all of the other Amazon accounts that you have associated with that email address. Believe me, I opened that can of worms years ago. You don't want to get in there. Just if you use email address A, just make sure to always use the same matching password for any and all Amazon accounts because you will modify passwords for other accounts without meaning to, and it gets complicated fast. For this video here, I will show you, I am logged in in the US account, in the Canadian account, and in the UK account. I also have a Germany, France, Spain, and Italy accounts, but I'm not gonna show them to you for the purpose of this video. But uh, if you make sales in those countries, feel free to apply to those countries as well. One thing to note is that the Amazon One Link is not available if you're not looking at the US account. So you will want to be logged into the US account and then go to Tools and One Link. This is where you will initiate the process of connecting your accounts. So the first step is right here. Just scroll down, click here to link your accounts. And you would just add the store IDs. I've already done this. The store IDs are located at the top. Notice how they are different from country to country. And these are the things that I have already linked. So just follow the instructions, add the store ID, and then they will prompt you to proceed with other things. And then after you've connected your accounts here, you can also update your settings as to how you want the redirection to work. You get to select one default tracking ID. So the tracking ID are the affiliate IDs. They are not the store ID. So when you create an affiliate link, let me show you here. I'm going to pretend create an affiliate link. You get to look at a tracking ID. These are the ones. By default, when you set up your affiliate accounts in each country, they will have assigned one tracking ID by default, but you can create more at any time. There is a maximum, but it's quite hard to reach. If you hover over your email address, you can see manage your tracking IDs. And then 
you could add a brand new tracking ID and you will see the existing list of tracking IDs that you already have. Note that you don't really control them. Nobody else in the same country's affiliate account can have the exact same, obviously, because Amazon needs to be able to assign a person or company to each link. So everybody is different and they add various numbers depending on the affiliate country. And these are out of your control. So you only get to pick one tracking ID per country. When all of that is set up, adding the link to your site is actually very easy. So for this particular book here, what I've done is I've used the amazon.com affiliate link. So to create that link, you will want to go to the amazon.com website and then look for a particular book that you want to create an affiliate link for. This is one of my books here. And I have the site Stripe installed. If you don't, you can go to Tools, Site Stripe, and follow the instructions to install that. Once you have it installed, if you're logged in to your associates account while visiting the Amazon.com website, this is important, you visit the product that you want to create an affiliate link for. As an extra step, if you want to delete all of the tracking that Amazon is currently doing, like how I looked for that book, just delete everything that happens after the Amazon ASIN code. Just reload the page to make sure that you did not inadvertently break the page. You can also get rid of the book title like this, but you will need to keep those extra letters and slashes in here. So again, I'm reloading the page to make sure. So this is a very clean URL. Now I will proceed to create the affiliate link again from the amazon.com website. I'm clicking to get link text. I'm going to select the tracking ID I want. And then it's important to select full link. The reason why you want to create this full link Notice how the first part is exactly what I have, followed by the tracking information that will tell Amazon this is associated with my affiliate ID. The full link is the one that is not glitchy. If you decide to use the short link, it will not always geo redirect correctly. So do select the full link so you can copy and paste this. So control C or command C with your mouse and then go to wherever you edit your website. And this is the URL that you would paste here. And then you just update your page. And then when you preview it, just double check that it goes to at least amazon.com. You can use a VPN service sometimes to test this out. Depending on the VPN service, sometimes it does not always work. But you can ask a friend located in Canada, for example, to test your link to make sure that it does redirect to amazon.ca to the book page on the Canadian store. So that's it. That's all you need to do if you want to earn affiliate money. And you can always go to your reports, review your earning report and the sales that came in after people click. So you get to see what's working on your site and what's not.